Hey, what's going on, y'all? Jimmy Malcolm. It's time for episode two of season two of Better Call Saul. Let's get to it. Oh, is that Chuck and Saul? Jimmy? Howard. Morning. Delivery for McGill. What are you doing here? Get that fucking up. Uh, is he embarrassed by his plane? That's kind of sad. Speaking of which, I have some news. He's working at Davis and me. Doing what? <laughs> They're aware of his background at Davis and Maine, his education. In the spirit of full disclosure, Cliff did talk to me beforehand, but I didn't stand in the way. Of course not. Nor should you. Partner track? I would, uh, yeah, <laughs> assume so. Great. <laughs> for Jimmy. That was very believable, absolutely. Thanks for coming by, Al. Anytime. You truly are missed. No pressure. <laughs> he really is? Jesus. I thought he might have fucking changed a little bit since he's missing Jimmy. Nope. The point stands. They know about his uh, background? Wow. She now want to sit next to Francis. Who the fuck is Francis? Document review will be coordinated to Aww. HHN. Three, list of all past and present official sandpiper vendors. Four, any and all business agreements and contracts. Is he not writing anything down? And its distributors. I thought they were rather close together. This is adorable. Oh, we should get one of those smokers. We could just barbecue for days. Yeah, we definitely got to get a smoker. She said it. I heard it. <laughs> Such a beautiful wrapping job. It's a shame to open. It's a gift. Be grateful. <laughs> Just keeping it real. See you tonight. Maybe. If you play your cards right. That's adorable. This is going to end horribly. Horribly. Well, end with him in a Cinnabon, but you know what I mean. Hello, beautiful. What do you think, ladies? Yeah, I know, right? Goodbye, hug? No? All right, well, forego the tears and just say, till we meet again. Damn, really? It's like that? I need a hug, bud. Smile over there. <laughs> That's not one of those guys. Smile, beautiful. You're too pretty to fucking have a frown on your face. I shouldn't be surprised they have to tell you this. But it's probably a bad idea that you willingly talk to the police, being a criminal and all. I'm not here as a criminal. <laughs> I'm here as a crime victim. Just because... If you already made your report, why are you here? Well, they called me. They have a few more questions. They are very dedicated to finding this thief. You are an idiot. Holy shit. Since you're new to this. No, no, no! I am getting those back. I will take the risk. No, you won't. Because then you'll be putting my well-being at risk. Those cards? Some something. of them were my dad's. Okay. Uh, I'm getting them back. Aw, that's almost sad. He wasn't such an idiot. We should discuss some sort of financial arrangement in which I... I uh, oh. Okay then. This is awesome. I didn't think I could fucking, I didn't think after season one, my favorite character to watch would be this ridiculous bum and his ridiculous car being ridiculous to Mike. The Tuco, Jimmy, Mike obviously is fantastic. I love Kim. If I had to keep watching one guy right now, it'd be dang. I'm sure to get old if he was on every second, but he's not, so it's hilarious. Opting in is a requirement for residency, which it sure seems to be. Well, their voluntary claims don't hold water. Might be onto something here. Goddamn right. Nice work, Jimmy. Yes, sir. Oh. 
Considering Chuck was playing music in the beginning, and this guy plays his guitar now, and he's fucking appreciative of Jimmy, I hope it is not to see him as like a, a older brother slash father figure. I'm not here for it. So you know he'll be a piece of shit. No offense. Uh, take a look. Mira? Ignacio, mi hijo! Si, papa! Vente, necesito! Ya voy! <laughs> Mike is splendid. Mike is splendid. How do you do that? Right, you said he did research on him. Mike's splendid. Mike is splendid. Said he did research on him. I guess I'll just have to take my chances, but good luck to you. You know, I was hoping you'd see our dilemma and do the right thing. But I think what we have here now is a carrot and stick situation. And the name of the stick is Tuco Salamanca. No, you don't play ball, so to speak, and Tuco finds out about your little side business. Got a big enough stick? And you net, roughly, roughly, 60,000. <laughs> no, exactly does that work. I love Mike. Pause. <laughs> I don't think you understand. And he's got this great voice. You know who he sounds like? Well, no, he sounds like, you know who he is? He's Commissioner Gordon in Arkham Knight. And now I can't help but see that when he talks. He says some words like family. Oh, shit! You think I'd be caught dead driving that thing? It looks like a school bus for 60 old pimps. All right, shall we move this along? <laughs> <laughs> now I have a visual of six year old pimps in my head. The Eisenhower administration. Of course, given some of their uh, inconsistent organizational practices, it's going to be slow going. I'm so sorry to interrupt. Oh, oh Chuck shows up now? It does right now. The world's second best lawyer is going to come in real symbolic right about now. Uh, getting uh, documents from some of the clients might be a little labor intensive, but our clients will always be our best resource. Plus, they have ribbon candy. <laughs> Thank you, Kim. You came through in the clutch. Oh, I love her. You're still morally flexible? If so, I might have a job for you. Where and when? Morally flexible. Put it on a t-shirt. Squat cobbler. What's a squat cobbler? Squat cobbler. You know what squat cobbler is. No, I don't, I don't know what a squat cobbler no, is. No, me neither. What is it? What the hell is a squat cop? It's when a man sits in pie. He sits in a pie. And he... He wiggles around. <laughs> Maybe it's like hell makes it more specialized. Not all pie sitters cry. But I'm gonna tell you something. This guy, he's... And they bought it? Yeah. Wow. I've heard some far out scenarios used to so doubt, but this definitely takes the cake. Kim. 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 She wearing a University of American Samoa yeah. shirt? Sorry. <laughs> Jimmy it's kept his stuff up in sweater. Right That's hilarious. Yeah. Wait, wait, you, you actually made a video? I, I gotta say, in the end, old Dan really committed. I believed the tears. Oh, this is a leftover prop. Is that true? I wasn't sure. You fabricated evidence? I made a video. Not exactly evidence. You used it to exonerate a client. You used falsified evidence to exonerate a client. I could not hear about this sort of thing. Ever again, okay? You won't. Better bring me down on the fish, Jesus. All right, that was episode two of season two of Better Call Saul, where to begin? While the finish brought me significantly down, Kim is not wrong. In fact, I think the word right is a word most people would use. Uh, she is correct, 100%. 
Why did Jimmy risk it for, uh, that's what he does? That's who he is? He's slipping, Jimmy? Chuck is right. Chuck's a piece of garbage, but he is a terrible brother, but he's right. We saw that in the last episode. Don't touch this. Leave it on. Had to stay on. He tries to, he's self-sabotaging himself. That's what he's doing. Self-sabotaging himself. He's sabotaging himself. Or he's self-sabotaging. Whatever you prefer. Um, but I'm here for it. That was hilarious. Uh, morally flexible is the term I'll be using from here on out. As big of an idiot as Daniel is, and he's huge, huge. I thoroughly enjoy watching him. Uh, not doing the pie thing, that'd be gross. The crying or not. But him and Mike together with like the most competent criminal ever, <laughs> with the least competent criminal ever, is splendid TV. I'm here for it. I'm here. I want Jimmy to do so well. I hate Chuck so much. I think he's right. Um, I think he showed up just because I don't know. I don't know what he wanted. I ain't gonna lie to you. I'm still not entirely sure what Chuck wants. I know what Chuck thinks. His thoughts have not changed since he laid the smack down on Jimmy. But I hope he comes around. I love Jimmy and Kim. It's a shame it's not going to work out. Anyway, uh, post your comments down below. Like, share, subscribe.